Today, we have a program here we want to apply here in our school called the ARR, Active Reciprocal Reading. So today we'll have a short lesson by practice this ARR so that we can see how useful it is. Are we together? Yes. Now, it depends on five fetch of all is predicting. Second one, equal reading, clarifying, questioning, and last one is summarizing. Now we're going to see how we can predict some pictures in order to get different what? information. Are we together? Yes. yes. Now everyone will have a picture. Yes. Take your picture. Two minutes. Pass through that picture. Look at the picture. Then just to predict what is going on in that picture. Now, what 
Activity, do you share with your sibling? Activity which you share with your sibling at home. Very good. Uh -huh. Yes, but then? To clean the surroundings. Clean surrounding, very good. Yes. Cooking. Cooking? Yes. Washing dishes. Washing dishes, washing utensils, very good. Yes, cleaning refrigerator, very good. Cleaning the environment. Cleaning the environment, very good. Fetching water. Fetching water, very good. Uh -huh. Yes. Mopping the floor. Mopping the floor, very good. Now, who can tell us which activity do you prefer to do at your home? Uh -huh. Good. Cleaning our uh, surroundings. Cleaning surroundings. Preparing dinner table, very good. Washing dishes. Washing dishes. Cooking. Cooking, good. Washing utensils. You washing utensils? Washing the car. Washing the car, good. Mopping the floor. Mopping the floor. Okay, enough. I very good. It seems you cooperate good with your sibling at home, okay? And now, what do you think girls and boys should share the household activities? How do you think? Is it good to share different activities or is it bad? Hmm? Who can tell us? What do you say about that? Mm -hmm. It is good because it builds a sense of cooperation. Build a sense of cooperation. Very good. It promotes gender equality. Very good. It's good good relationship. It's good good relationship. Very good. It it makes a better bond and unity between them. Yes, very good. What word, another? Yes, it safe time. Safe time, good. Yes, very good. Thank you. I'm happy because everyone was able to predict the picture. Are we together? Yes. Now, we have a paragraph which will practice the second task about eco, eco reading. Here, a teacher will read a sentence and the class will echo back. Are we together? Yes. We will go back with the same pace, tone, and the emphasis. Are we together? You know what is eco reading? A teacher read and you echo, you echo back. There are some words which have emphasis. It emphasizes something. So you have to echo as that emphasis says. Are we together? Yes. Now, I will read. Then you will echo back. Are we together? Mm -hmm. Take your papers. Start. Hooray! Africa has changed. Hooray! Africa has changed. Hooray! Africa has changed. societies, efforts to address gender discrimination and humiliation are promising. In many African societies, efforts to address gender discrimination and humiliation are promising. Both boys and girls receive better treatment, especially on the access to education and other considerations. Both boys and girls receive better treatment, especially on the access to education and other considerations. Girls are now given opportunities to go to school and engage in public services just like boys. Girls are now given opportunities to go to school and engage in public services just like boys. Both girls and boys are not 
started to share responsibilities in family equally. Both girls and boys are not to share responsibilities in the family equally. Women nowadays contest for different leadership positions. Tanzania, bringing confidence and faith in women. The fact that we have Samia Sulu Hassan as the first female president in Tanzania brings confidence and faith in women. More women should be encouraged to contest for various political positions. More women should be encouraged to contest for various political positions. Men no longer dictate decisions over women. Men no longer dictate decisions over women. Women are empowered economically social and political. Women are empowered economically, socially and political. They have equal contribution to the families, well-being as they work together with men to support children's education. They have equal contribution to the families, shelter for the family. They also collaborate with men to provide shelter for the family. Women take care of their parents. Women take care of their parents. Men are now relieved of being the only provider for the family. Men are now relieved of being the only providers for the family. Thank you, Africa. Thank you, Tanzania. Thank you, my village and my family. Thank you, Africa. Thank you, Tanzania. My village and my family. Gender discrimination should be completely stopped in Tanzania. Gender discrimination should be completely stopped in Tanzania. Very properly, you equal, proper. Now, the next task is clarifying means that there are some vocabularies or hard words which are used in this paragraph. Are we together? These words in one way or another was difficult to you. Now, you can find their meaning so that you can make what? You can get a general information about the paragraph. Are we together? Yes. In your paper, we analyze those words there. The first one is early marriage. We have peer pressure, treasure education, sibling, a leader, whispering, mass media, and the hooray. Are we together? Yes. yes. Now, let us go to find the meaning of each vocabularies as used in our paragraph. The first one, let us start with early marriage. Is there anyone who knows what is early marriage? Do you know early marriage? Yes, tell us what is early marriage. Early marriage 
in the marriage which happens before completely the age of being married. Very good. Another one? Yes. In the marriage, every marriage, every marriage, in the marriage, which girl marry before the the age of marriage to complete. Very good. Is there anyone else want to add the meaning of marriage? Is the state of being married under the right age. Very good. All of you, you are correct because. When you say early marriage, is someone who is married before his proper age. Who can tell us someone has to be married in which age? In which age? 18. 18? And above. Very good. Because when you reach 18, you are an adult. You can make your own what? Number is peer pressure. Peer pressure. Is there anyone who knows what is peer pressure? Um, yes, welcome. Tell us. Peer pressure is the action. When you see, you see people in your, in in your age, you do body behavior. For example, for example, you are, you see the friend you are not to come to school. This is the. Peer pressure. Very good. Is there anyone else? Yes. Peer pressure is the act of someone being do, do, doing something that's the same of, of the other someone who is in her age. For example, doing something the same. Good. Yes. Peer pressure is a act, a act of someone do something like someone has done. Very good. Now let us remember, all of you, you are you are correct. But according to how this word used in our paragraph is the feeling that one must do the same thing like others do. This is based on the people of the same words, same age. As you saw in our para, in our what in our picture, you see siblings do different activities. So peer pressure. When you talk about relatives or siblings in our family, they have some same age, okay? So they can do the same thing like the other other do. Are we together? Are we together, class? Yes. Okay. Let us proceed. Another. Vocabulary is treasure education. Treasure education. Who can tell us what does it mean? Or how do you understand this word as used in our sentence? Treasure education is education who someone go to have it because he want to use it in his job. Very good. Teenage education refers to education whereby someone acquires it in order to get a job, not studying as other studies. Very siblings. Siblings. What does it mean? Siblings. Yes, all of you. Siblings is the people who related by blood or is the black birth by one people or one parent. Very your feelings, how much you success? Very good. You do Now, the last century that only girls were busy on doing home activities and going to school to study. I think that in this new century, it is different because the last century only, only girls were busy in doing home activities and not going to school, while boys were going to school so that they could get education. Very good. I know that African con content, there was many countries that are not have a eco into boys and girls. The, boy, the boys were going to school and have education, but girls, they didn't go to school. They, ha they do the house 
all the chores. Very idea and good information in our story. Are we together? Yes. As you have, you have said before, African society, most of siblings were not cooperate to do home activities. That's why in our heading here, hooray, Africa has changed. It means it changed from one state to another state of either only girls to do home activities, not boys. But nowadays, both boys and girls are doing home activities. Not only that, even women are contesting into different positions, especially political positions. A women can lead. Not only men can lead, yeah, okay? Yes. And another thing here, when we are talking about it, our country, Tanzania, here in our paragraphs, they say, thank you, Tanzania. Why they say, thank you, Tanzania? Because they, our leaders are insisting much in cooperate men and women. They are insisting about the gender equality. equality. Also, women can engage into different activities. That's why they say, thank you, Tanzania. And they say we have to thank our president who is a woman, is it? Eh? Mama Samia Solo Hassan is a woman. She can lead us, okay? She leads many and women and she, she can, okay? Are we together? Yes. Uh, lastly, is you after getting this information, can you be able to go and insisting about gender equality in your family yes. or in your societies? Yes. Can you be able? Yes. Because we are learning here in order to go to practice in our society or in our families. If you have your brother who don't want to engage in home activity, he don't want to cook, he don't want to fetch water, he don't want to, to, to sweep, go and tell him he is supposed to do those activities because we are equal. Are we together? Eh? Yes. Imagine you cook, he eats. Can't he be able to cook? He can cook also and then girl can eat that food cooked by, by men. Are we together? Yes. Thank you for listening me. My name. My name is Madam Anna Tairo of secondary school. Thank you for listening.